your Samsung Z Fold 6 has the black screen of death. You try holding the power button, charging, nothing's working. So the first fix is we just need to long press both power and volume down. So press and hold these two down and keep them held down for between 15 and 45 seconds. So what this will do is it will initiate a force restart. The phone may be actually on even though the screen's black and by doing power and volume down this will forcefully restart the device. Once you see the Samsung logo you can then release. If this is not working then either the battery cable or the display cable has unplugged from the phone. So that's okay we can fix this one. So what you do is you get two thumbs and we'll start from the back of the screen and we just want to press on the back of the screen with maximum force using our thumbs and so we're just trying to push that cable to unplugged back into the phone now you will hear a loud click that should represent that the cable has been plugged in so do the full back of the phone like this so just do the full back then do the front as well so two fingers just push maximum force put as much force as possible you're not going to break the phone by doing this so just repeat this for the full back if you don't hear any clicks I'd also recommend tapping so I'll put it on the desk here and so we're just gonna tap as hard as possible just through the full back of the phone again this will not break your device and uh, then we'll do the front uh, with the front you want to have one hand held on the screen so it doesn't like jitter and then just press as hard as you can and do the full front you want to spend a good five minutes on this. I'm speeding this up for the presentation. Then repeat the power and volume down. You may want to try charging your phone first. Final thing to check. If your charging port looks like there's dirt in there, you can use a flashlight to check. Use your SIM ejector tool. And then you can use that to just remove any like dust or gunk that's in the device. Make sure the SIM ejector tool is like the same way as the charging port like this so you can fill it in and then you can use that to clean the port as well.